Uh, we are joined by Congress's member of the Parliament, Ninong Ering, sir. 10.45 is uh, the Congress's uh, Parliamentary Committee meeting. Your Congress Vice President Rahul Gandhi is likely to make a statement on the floor of the House. But the bigger question here is, uh, you are not against the monetization move, but you are against the manner in which it has been implemented. So does the opposition, especially the Congress party, have any solutions, have any options that could be suggested to the government as far as proper implementation is concerned? Or is it just a voice that the opposition is making in the Parliament. No, this is not like that. Uh, as uh, Madam uh, Sonia Gandhi and uh, our President and uh, our Vice President Rahul Gandhi has very, you know, very clearly they have, uh, you know, uh, told the, the media or even in Parliament that we are not against uh, the demonetization. We, we, the system that is there, you know, we are in uh, support of the, you know, how we can, you know, curb uh, black money or. Um, uh, even this uh, corruption. But the thing is that now what uh, the latest position is that uh, the practical thing that is down on, on the earth. W let us not say about that we are going to uh, stop curb, uh, corruption or black money. See, th because of the five elections that are taking place, I think that is the one reason he has taken the decision at the you know, right moment where he thinks. Then, you know, we call it Jumla Baji. So he is taking another act that where we can, you know, be full of people. Now the people everywhere you ask, even in the lines who are having these problems, they also said that, yes, uh, we are in support of Modi. We said, yes, we are against corruption, we are against black money. But what our Vice President wants to show, or what we are also trying to show, is that the system, you know, that manage has been so poor that we are going to face a lot of problems, especially in the Northeast, where, you know, you have to walk six days. Imagine those guys coming from there with all uh, they, they must, in the last 20 years or so, they must have earned about 1 lakh, 2 lakh, or at least 60, 70,000. And when you come there and you say, no, you can only put 4 lakhs, uh, sorry, 4,000, how, how do you expect these people to do? Because they don't have bank accounts. They don't have bank accounts. In a place like Vijayanagar, where you have to walk six days, how do you expect people to, you know, uh, you know, uh, meet the demands? So at least you should have given a time or some, you know, kind, because Arunachal is not like, or the Northeast is not like, uh, you know, Delhi or the rest of the mainland in India. We already have a problem today itself. I've seen the news that one of my colleagues, uh, friends, uh, Mr. Bamang Tago, he was a manager. Imagine, you know, it's a very big disgrace to the country. A manager of the badminton team is not allowed to go to China because he says an ex-staple visa line. These issues are not looked into. But, but when the Congress uh, Vice President Rahul Gandhi yeah. comes out and says that it's a knee-jerk reaction, it is an unplanned, uh, uh, you know, an scheme implemented by yeah. the government. But the bigger question here is that the government has been uh, uh, announcing various relaxations um, in the sense the exemptions that were there till 12th of November, yeah. they have been extended to 14th and now till 24th, 24th. of no November yeah. again. So when the opposition is demanding something, when the opposition is saying that the implementation was unplanned, are there any solutions that you are also ready to so give to the government? You tell me a solution. So we have the orange season now. Okay, about paddy and um, uh, mustard, okay, we, it can wait for some time. But what about oranges? These are perishable items. You have to think something for them also, for the farmers, for the poor people, for the laborers. You know, a 2,000 rupee note you are giving to a laborer or you take out from the ATM, he goes to the market, it's the same case, he doesn't get a change. So how is going to, you know, basic necessities, amenities have to be looked into. So this, you know, kind of, you know, they should have, you know, uh, studied it thoroughly and they should have implemented it and or they should have given some time it's not against you know we are not saying that we are uh, not supporting you in the case of corruption or black money but the black money he had assured that he would bring it back and give it to each and every person with 15 lakhs now where is the 15 lakhs everyone is uh, in jandan yojana everyone has opened accounts now the pandara lakh kab aayega uske liye hum chinta hai na that uske liye chinte the sab is the congress vice president going to lead the charge in the lok sabha today will he be making a statement on the floor of the house as well? Uh, this is for the party to decide. We are going to have a meeting just now at 10.45. But the thing is that our leader is against corruption, she is against black money and uh, we have asked uh, our, uh, this thing, we have given notice for adjournment by our uh, leader, Mr. Kharge ji. So if he allows, uh, he may give a chance to our Vice President. So just my last question to you. The government has already said that they are ready for a healthy debate. We are seeing the discussion being taken place in the Rajya Sabha. Debates take place in everywhere. Debates take place everywhere. But the thing is, how you want to manage it, how you are going to satisfy this poor people. Now they are saying, that, okay, we are, we are giving you a 50 days time. I don't think it will be solved in 50 days. You know, India is such a vast country. You know, you have the difficulties. You know, the resources are very less. And the way the money is not being, you know, supplied. No, hoarding is taking place. Hoarding of 100 rupee notes, hoarding of small notes. Now you see, uh, <coughs> in one way you have, uh, you know, introduced corruption. You'll see this, you know, laborers, I, I, I just 
it's on the TV in some of your channels that the guys are standing there. They're changing notes. They stand in line. They give a call, call to the person who wants the ATM or for the change of notes. And now they put this indelible link. You know, it's it, it's not a disgrace for us. This is put only during elections. And now even for a change of money, you're doing this a very big yeah, disgrace. You know, the opposition fight, especially the Congress's fight, will continue in the parliament. Yes, yes, it will be for the people, for the people who are facing these difficulties. All right. Thank, thank you. you so much for joining us on Times Now. So